Yes, members, just elaborating more on differentiation. I had forgotten something, but it could be crucial for someone who is able and willing to learn. <coughs> As I told you in the earlier video, now, if I say Y, and someone also says F of X, this also could mean the same. Not could. This means the same. It's just equating to something for an equation. Now, as I told you that dy, also dx, this one could also be not could. It is the same as derivative. You could say derivative or differentiate or anything, depending on the English first derivative of x it could also mean that the same some might give you this simple it means differentiate in case you see this one also means differentiate differentiating y with respect to x so that's the one of the more most important thing which i had left out for someone who is willing to learn now we are going to look at uh, differentiating certain functions if I would say they may give you something like y is equal to 3x plus 2x squared x squared plus 3x and they tell you, you differentiate y, or find the y dx, or find the derivative, which is f an apostrophe, then x. Now, as I told you, differentiation, <coughs> multiply the power first. So this one will be our dy dx, or f that apostrophe x is equal to, I hope you are getting. So this will become three x to power two y. I've brought I've brought the three in front of x. Then I I subtracted one from the th power three. Then I remain with the two. That's how I came across with that. And here I will get four x to power one. Even though I don't write power one, it will still be x. Then, here I will get only 3. Remember, here it is to power 1. If I multiply 1 times 3, I will get 3. Now, 1 minus 1, it will be 0. Anything to power 0 is 1. So, 1 times 3 is 3. Uh, I think that was some of the important thing I left out. And I believe it is useful for any student. Uh, maybe what I need to also elaborate <coughs> more. What if they say, find a derivative of this equation, y equals to x, and they want you to find the y dx. They want you to find it. Now, from here you see x, it has a silent one. You agree? So, it has a silent one. If I'm able to get the dy dx, I will say this one, which is silent, will come and multiply this x, then I will subtract the one. So, I will be having one times the x to power zero. But anything to power zero, anything to power zero is one. So, it will be one times 1. I hope you get me, which will be 1. Uh, thank you. I think I needed to elaborate more also on that, but uh, we are continuing. I'm doing a series on differentiation as we are going further. Watch out for the next video. Please like, subscribe, share, comment. If anything, is not understood. I'm, I will be willing to help and uh, 
cooperate with you. Thank you very much. Remember our channel, Elevo Math is, a, is the name of our channel. Thank you very much.